first startup of the new Microsoft Connect, and let's see how this baby goes. Let's go ahead and turn on the Xbox. Everything's plugged in, everything's set up. If you guys have any problems setting up yours, definitely check out my setup video, and you guys will be able to figure that out really easily. You guys can see there's a light flashing on the Connect sensor. And it says to use this device, an update must be applied. So, if you guys still have, after getting Connect, if you still have a controller, I guess now is when you might want to turn it on and use it just to do the update uh, if you have one necessary. Alright, so it looks like Connect is ready to go. Right there, ready to be the controller. Let's set up. So, what we're going to do now is uh, press A to continue. So, we're going to go ahead and press A on our controller. Hopefully this will be one of the last times we have to use this. Best position, make sure your controller is two to six feet from the floor. Check. <laughs> Centered above or below your TV. And placed on a stable surface. I have a double stick taped to the little stand over there, as you guys can see. Sensor placed. This process will open. Start by checking the background noise in your room when available. All right, so let's go ahead and press test background noise. Alright, so it had to be quiet as possible, it said, and now your background noise level is okay. Make sure the speaker volume is at the level you use to play games. This will check your speaker volume by playing some sound. My speaker level is okay. <laughs> this test will use sound to help orient connect in your room. Your audio setup may affect connect. Select more info for details. Let's just go ahead and calibrate it now. We'll go ahead and you might want to, if you have your connect sensor close to the speakers where your TV are, uh, so you guys see I have the speakers there close to the connect sensor, you might want to move it or eventually buy the TV mount. So let's go ahead and calibrate it. Calibrating the microphone, this will take about a minute. You'll hear calibration sounds twice. Please be as quiet as possible until notified. Microphone calibration complete. If you turned up the volume, you can turn it back down. All right. So Connect has a built-in uh, chat microphone for games and Xbox Live parties. Do you want to use Connect for chat? Uh, turn the microphone on to use Connect Center for chat. Yeah, we'll have it on for chat. Why not? You guys can choose to have that on or off. Totally up to you. There we go. Connect. Setting up Connect. I already told you guys a uh, quick little setup video. It's very simple. <laughs> first stand up kind of obvious one person only please put the controller down sweet will do make sure the area is clear my area is clear except for this tripod move in front of the sensor I'm in front of said sensor stay there ooh oh yeah oh yeah wave to interact with connect yeah select an option Hold your hand over the panel to select it. Sweet. You're all now set up to go. Have you're all set up. Now go have fun. To go ahead and wave our hand over done. Woo! That is awesome. No controller. Alright, you can interact with your console in a whole new way with Connect. Learn about using your hands, the Connect Hub, the God Gesture as well. Alright, so let's see what we got here. Put the controller back down. Someone's hopping in to play up, and we need the controller. <laughs> the play space is an area where Connect can see you. So that's going to be the area that's going to be right in front of you, right in front of the sensor. It says, this is what Connect can see. Your hands glow when Connect sees you. A hand icon also appears when Connect sees you. When you see it, you can wave. In the Xbox dashboard, wave until the Connect hub opens. So that's cool. You can just be on the dashboard and start waving your hand and the Connect Hub will open. In the Connect Hub, you can start Connect Games and Experiences. Very cool. Move your hand over the items you want to select. Hold your hand over it. Hold your hand still over the item to select it. When the ring is complete, the item is selected. So you're going to basically put your hand over a certain space on the screen that you want and eventually it'll stay there for a certain amount of time and that'll know, they'll, that's when Connect will know that you uh, want that certain item. To make a guide gesture, hold the left hand out to the side and keep your right hand down. So that's basically how you're going to make a gesture uh, to bring up the guide. The guide icon will appear. 
hold it, the ring is complete, the game is paused, and the menu opens. So if you ever need a break. Connect game menu has resume, lead game settings, connect guide, choose either one with your hand, and the connect game menu is like connect guide to access friends, messages, and more. The connect guide works like the connect hub, just hold your hand over it and an item to select it. Select the back if you need to, and you can resume the game. If you have any problems with Connect, the Connect Tuner can help find and fix them. It can also fine tune Connect your, to your play space. Go to the Connect Tuner when the sensor doesn't see you or hear you well. So if you ever have any problems calibrating, go to that Connect uh, Center there. Uh, if you're in the Connect Hub page, left or right, and you can wave left or right to move around. If you're in Xbox Dashboard, go to My Xbox, System Settings, Connect Settings, and Connect Tuner to fix any problems you may have. With Connect, you control your Xbox wirelessly with the voice. This section will cover the microphone. When you see the microphone icon, your console is listening for commands. Xbox. Saving Xbox shows available commands. Saving Xbox. You can use voice commands with Connect to go to different game option menus. To have your Xbox follow command, you have to say Xbox first and then the command you want. Alright guys, we're all set and we can start out on the dashboard. Alright, so that's what you guys are going to go through the first time you're setting up your Connect. Alright, you guys can see the little Connect demo right down there in the corner. It shows, you guys can see those bright colors, that's where my hands are. Let's go ahead and wave. Alright, so it knows we want it. Alright, so I waved over to the Connect hub. If you see it, just say.